The singer recently celebrated a Bridgerton themed party out in the Hamptons. Ben Affleck, unfortunately, nowhere in sight. But according to our News Nation senior story editor, Paula Froelich, Ben will be joining her this week out there, you know, chilling a little bit. Paula, are we saying hold on to those rumors about uh, there no, being no more love in the house, that they are still doing just fine? Oh, no, I never said they were doing just fine, Nick. <laughs> Let's be honest. You missed someone's big birthday. It's her 55th birthday. And no. However, they are taking a break. And my sources say he is flying out this week and, and next week to spend some time and so they can hang out. Uh, but he did miss her birthday. It was kind of shocking. Although, ish. He hates those kind of things. It was Bridgerton themed. Everyone shows up to her watermill house. They're all dressed in these ball gowns. And it was hot. It was very hot. And Ben's not really into dress up. So there you go. And Ben's a simple guy from Boston. He's like, I don't want to do all this. Babe, if you want to sit back yeah. and watch a movie, we can do that. But yes, I don't want does. to be wearing powdered wigs and things, <laughs> eating birthday cake. Yeah. yeah. No. Paula, this one is one I really want to talk to you about because, you know, when I was young, I never needed anyone. Exciting oh, news boy. for Celine Dion fans, right? <laughs> She'll be performing Friday well, at the opening ceremony for the 2024 Olympics in Paris. What details can you share? Well, first of all, Nick, you know I'm your lady, and you are my man. And all I have to say is we both need a raise because she's getting $2 million to perform at the opening ceremony of the Olympics. But that's just what she's getting paid. They're probably shelling out closer to 4 to $5 million because they had wow. to charter a private jet. They're firing in her friends and family, her doctors, and her physical therapist, setting her up in a huge suite. And, you know, this is all because of stiff person syndrome. This is her big, hopeful comeback. We, she had that movie where we saw her in so much pain, and the pain is also caused by joy and excitement. So this is going to be a big test as to whether she can actually go and do the Vegas residency I reported she's in talks for. Paula, this is absolutely fantastic. At one point in the documentary mm -hmm. that you mentioned, she talks about how she feels like she's an apple tree and everybody wants an apple and she has no more apples to give. And then one fan yeah. said, no, Celine, we come for the tree, not the apples. I almost 100%. lost it, Paula. That was beautiful. I'm hope I'm please. I was at the premiere. I was sobbing. It was weird. Well, Paula, with you, I'm never all by myself. News Nation oh, no, Senior didn't. Story Editor, Paula Froelich. Paula, love you. Talk to you soon. Thanks for watching, everybody. Go to joinnn.com to find News Nation on your television provider. Also, don't forget to click that red subscribe button below to get more of News Nation's fact-driven, unbiased coverage.